Ian Wagter, Lumar Machining and Manufacturing Limited. I'm uh, Jack Wagter. My son and I are the owners of uh, Lumar Machining. We have 18 employees. We have seven Akuma machine tools, uh, four lathes, and three mills. I would worked for a couple of other uh, manufacturing companies and uh, my father has uh, owned two different stamping companies. I'd always wanted to buy something on my own. He said he wanted to do something else. So I said, well, what do you want to do the rest of your life? And he said, well, I would mind working for myself. By uh, looking around, talking to agents, uh, we found Lumar Machining. He felt very strongly that uh, it had a great opportunity, had a good customer base and a uh, very good employee base. The company was basically two customers at the time. They were uh, all automotive and the shop was entirely manual. We like to uh, joke about the fact that the highest tech piece of equipment in the shop was a fax machine. And we really didn't start focusing on growth until about 2005, at which point we started to make the transition over to the CNC equipment. This is our first Akuma lathe that we purchased. You can see we're missing the A off the uh, door, and I've left that off because the, it represents to me what Akuma stands for. We've had no maintenance issues whatsoever on the equipment, except for one item. And uh, about a year or two ago, we had the light bulb blow inside the uh, machine and we couldn't see in. In order to keep operating, the operator clamped an auxiliary light onto the door, and unfortunately it took the A off but it uh, just helps us to uh, remind how constant the equipment's been for us. Diversification took a few years. We've uh, got some parts in the recreational area, uh, making parts for skulls or the Olympic-style rowboats. We're roughing some landing gear out for uh, aircraft, and we're doing some downhole stuff for the uh, oil and gas industry. Still got the automotive. Uh, we were able to land a little bit of uh, aerospace related work. I feel there's an underserviced area in the low quantity, high precision, complicated part area. We're trying to service the market from a, a five to 40 off part quantity. The Akuma machine tools are allowing us to set up quickly with high precision and repeatability. This is our uh, Space Turn LB4000EX. We've been able to uh, get lots of extra work with it due to the size capability. It's got a meter and a half turn length with Y-axis milling. Uh, we've also got the steady rest on it and all the tooling for uh, deep drilling and boring. Uh, it's been a great machine. Having the right tools is half the battle. I have 100% confidence in the Akuma equipment. I know that my crew does as well. Uh, I had one operator in particular uh, that actually is the operator of our first lathe. He was very resistant to grab onto the technology, um, but an exceptional machinist and he's uh, grabbed a hold of it and is, does a great job with that machine now. And he actually came to me a couple years after and looked at me and shook his head and he said, you know, if we hadn't have gone this way, we wouldn't be in business right now. He ended, learned very fast and very well. He's dedicated to make this company continue to grow and uh, diversify and make it grow into the direction that gives us uh, a niche market. Come on now, I'm his father. <laughs> My goal is to triple the size of the business within the next three years, and that's the reason that we're trying to make the move into a new building right now. Welcome to the new home of Lumar. The new space we're looking at is 25,000 square feet. We're in six right now. We're crammed in, and we should probably be running out of eight or nine. Oh, this is a new facility. Starting in the back corner, we'll set up the milling department, and then moving across, we'll get into the bigger mills, and then into the turning and the back corner uh, is hopefully going to be the home of a 750 Multis at some point. That's the dream anyway. Endless opportunity. Got lots of plans and hopefully a great future ahead of us.